This here's a story, an untold story, about a man who saved the world more times than anyone knows. Sometimes you need a place to escape. Retirement. That's what old James did. He needed a place of solitude, a place to gather his thoughts. But sometimes, when you spend time alone, you have to wonder. Is this what you really want? Sometimes this man has to ask himself, am I still brave? These are the thoughts that have been haunting James. But he needed a sign that the world was ready for him. World domination. That's the plan. Once we get to the southern border of Congo, it's over for them. They're all gonna burn. We got them surrounded down at the southern border of South Africa. We got cannonballs, guns, pocket knives, flip switches. There's just one problem. What is it, Bruce? We gotta take out Jane. James, I gotta tell Jimmy. Domination. World domination? That's the plan. World domination. Get on. That's what I was afraid of. If it ain't, it ain't Paul Hatchet himself. Mr. T? I thought I told you to leave the country. I did. But I'm back. So what's this here about world domination? Well, I was scouting out the enemy, and uh, they're in Congo right now, but they have troops moving in on South Africa, okay? All right. So they also know not exactly where you are, but they know you're in eastern Ohio. Well, you know, Polly, I'm retired. Yeah, well, it's like the fate of the world rests in your hands once again. Well, Mr. T, let's get to it. Good enough, James. Oh. Come on, James, you can do better. I'm trying. You can do better. I'm trying. <laughs> Yeah. 
So, Mr. T. Yeah? I've been uh, yeah. meaning to ask you. What's that? What's the story between you and that dustpan there? This one? No, I'm not sure. Mm. Well, this dustpan here, it's been uh, handed down generation to generation, my family. My, my daddy killed his first man with this here dustpan. I figure I might as well keep up the tradition. Kill him in with the dustpan? Kill him in with this dust here dustpan. It's the only weapon I've ever owned, the only one I've ever needed. What about you? What about me? Let's start with that there hacksaw. Well, it's a hatchet, but it's an easy mistake. Uh, well, my dad's last name was actually Hacksaw. And he always had this hacksaw going down from generation to generation, sort of like Mr. T over here with his dustpan. And, but I wasn't, I didn't really feel that relationship to the hacksaw as I did with this hatchet here. Cause he made, I was just out there cutting wood, eating caterpillars, and my dad made me come inside. He said, if you don't want to be a hacksaw man, you gotta get out of this family. So, I went, started my own family. I started the Hatchet family. What's up, Tony? General Polinski just got back to me. James Bond has been located. Where at? In the small town of Zelensky. Well, that's not far from where we are. Well, then they'll never expect it. Let's go get them. Wait. We gotta get groceries. Okay. Gotta go. Here it goes. Here it goes. That's them over there. What are we gonna do? I'll take care of this, boys. This is what they train for. Come on, Jimmy.
now, huh, Buster? Huh? Yeah, well... Whoa! <laughs> I never liked you anyway. <laughs> Not so fat, pulpit. Yeah, it's too bad about Tony. Yeah. He and I were best buds back in the day. World domination. That was the plan. Come on, Jimmy. Oh, God. Oh, get my hat. Well, Jimmy, we did it again. Save the day. I'm back. Good job, Jimmy. James Bond. 